What's up guys? I just recorded episode one, but I wasn't really happy with the intro. I wanted to do a proper intro and say thank you very much. Uh, by popular demand, I am bringing back Green Hell. People want to see me play this game. They've been asking me to play this game left, right, and center, and I'm going to be bringing it back. Just remember guys, if you like the videos and you want to see more of this series, make sure to hit that like, like button and sub for future videos. I really do appreciate it and it really does help. Also, I just want to take this opportunity to say I have a Discord server with a Green Hell chat set up specifically for this game obviously it's called green hell chat you can come there to share your own builds you know share your tips whatever you like uh the link will be in the description so enjoy the video guys what's up amazon survivors this is kg48 and welcome to a brand new let's play for green hell and this is not just any let's play for green hell this is going to be green hell 1.0 it is out of early access it actually came out of early access on september 5th which is just freaking phenomenal um one of the things they did add in this update that i wanted to address right off the bat is um they do have a story mode i'm not gonna do the story mode because like it's all over youtube already like everyone's already done it so like i feel like i'd kind of be wasting my time at that point um so i'm just gonna go ahead and play survival there's been a lot of updates um can I punch that? No, you can't. Um, yeah, there's been a lot of updates, a lot of stuff like put into the game. Uh, you know, we're going to talk about it as we go, but let's get started here. Uh, first thing I'm going to want to do is I think I'm... Thought I heard something. First thing I want to do is I'm going to want to head towards the drug facility, okay? I definitely want to stay at the drug facility. And uh, that is going to be... All right, I was just trying to, like, figure out how to change the, you know, dial on my watch. And, yeah, it's the mouse wheel. All right, so the drug facility. I do still have my uh, text files here with all the uh, locations. Hopefully the drug facility is in the same spot. We're going to find out. It is 51 West, 27 South. So we just keep having to head that way. And I think we will come up to the drug facility. All right, so um, what do we do here, man? It's been so freaking long. I don't remember how to do anything. Um, well, let's come over here and let's get some rope to start with. We're going to grab some of these... Uh, liana off of the tree grab some of this rope that's basically rope so we're gonna do that we're also gonna look for some uh stones on the ground and the first thing i think we're gonna have to watch out for is snakes we got to make sure we watch out for snakes I, if i remember correctly snakes was the big bad in the beginning of the game for me um obviously we have to worry about pumas and big cats and stuff like that but they tend to come out a little bit more at night um if you're wondering that that brings me to another point um, if you're wondering what difficulty, one of the things that they put in this update was the difficulty. I am playing on King of the Jungle, which is three out of four as far as like hardest to easiest. So I don't remember how to craft anything in this game. So let's see uh, if we can craft anything. I don't know. Maybe we could do, I think we need two of those, don't we? I think you can make uh, some kind of very basic, very basic um, thing there. But I think you got to put two stones together um, for that in order to like make some kind of, I don't know, some other kind of stone. So we're just going to continue along here. We're going to look for some more stones. Okay, and I'm really freaking paranoid. By the way, there's supposed to be a map in the game now. I'm not really sure to get to that. We'll have to figure that out. That right there is going to be our healing uh, things, which we're going to need something to uh, break that down. And I think you need, I think you need two stones to do anything, right? Yeah, you need two stones to do anything. So let's find another stone, and then we're going to get started. So what, what's been new in this, um, in this update? Obviously, story mode. Okay. Um, then they have the uh, new map areas, new difficulties. They have an in-game map and lootable bags. I don't know how you do the in-game map. But I'm not sure if it's something you have right off the right at the beginning, or if it's something I need to find. Maybe I need to find a map or craft a map. I don't know. So it's probably something you have to find. I can't just imagine you would magically have a map. Freaking paranoid in this game again. I haven't played this game in quite a long time. Um, so let's go ahead and take that big stone and we're going to harvest that into three small stones. And then I believe we need to put two stones together to make some kind of other stone. Yes, yeah, stone blade. All right, I think the idea is you take one stone and kind of break off the pieces of the sides with the one stone on the other stone. And that's how you get the stone blade. So I think I, think I can make some kind of basic um, axe here with the stone blade. Uh, oh, there we go. Nope, not the stone pickaxe. I don't want a stone pickaxe. Gosh darn it. I'm gonna have to throw that away too because it's gonna take up inventory space. Um, yeah, I got a stone pickaxe. Watch out. Freaking Amazon jungle. All right, so which way am I heading again? I need to be heading west. So we need to be heading this way. All right. So I, I, I think maybe we need two... What is that? Oh, a snail. I'll grab that. Um, I think we need two stones, right? For the uh, two of those stone blades for the axe. I'm not really sure. Let's just go ahead and turn these. You can actually use the stone blade itself. So I'll just use that in the meantime. There we go. 
Got the stone blade. That'll help me get some stuff like the Molinaria um, bushes and stuff. You know, you take the Molinaria and you basically make uh, bandages with that. Crafting items increase your skills. Yes, you do have skills in this game. And you want to craft items to increase them. And I, if I remember correctly, there's a snake at the top of this uh, thing here. Thank goodness I don't have to go that way. Alright, so let's go this way and see what we can find. Just gonna kind of look around and be careful. We don't. We haven't saved our game yet. You need to make like a, you know, a shelter to save your game. So if we die, it's like starting from the beginning again. So that would be a, uh, not cool. Right there is grubs. I'm gonna leave those alone because you can eat them. But the problem with the grubs is they mess with your sanity. Um, they'll kind of make your guy very upset. Oh, we got some fruit over here. All right. So we got an armadillo there. We're gonna leave him alone, and we're gonna grab some of this fruit. Fruit does not give a lot of carbohydrates. If you're new to this game, by the way, you hold down the F key to bring up your watch, use the mouse wheel to scroll around. And right there, top left hand red is protein. Top right is carbohydrates. Bottom right is drink. And bottom left is fats. Yes, yes. This is um this is definitely one of the more hardcore survival games that I play. Um but it's a lot of fun, you know? It's um it's not like boring or anything. They make it interesting, you know? And uh, that is just awesome. So we're going to just keep heading west here. Uh, again, I have a place I want to stay. It's called the drug, drug Facility. You'll see why when we get there. What was that? I heard something. Got to watch out. There's, there's, these, uh, there's these big freaking spiders. And I think they're called something bird eaters or something. Like, yeah, they are big nasty spiders. You got to watch out for those suckers. You'll hear them though. They're pretty loud. Although, I don't know how loud they're going to be because I was messing around with my uh, sound when I first started the game. So, I don't know. My sound might be a little low. But it's it's going to take like a video to get that right. Um, and I'll, I'll listen back to this later. Make sure I you know, got it right. It sounds like it's pretty good to me. All right. So, anytime you see these dead trees, there's usually going to be uh, beehives on them. So, be careful with that. Although, I don't hear the bees yet. Usually, if you don't hear them, it might not be there. That's a spider, I think. That sounds like the spider. The bird eater. Alright, so let's go this way. I'm not sure if that was a spider. It might not have been. But it sounded like it could have been. Ooh, bananas. Bananas! There we go. Check out the bananas. These will grow back as well on that tree. I guess they can grow on any banana tree. I'm not really sure. But... Gotta be a little bit quiet here. I like to give, I like to give commentary. But man, I gotta be a little quiet. We're gonna go ahead and uh, harvest that stone. You can pick up those big stones, but then you have to, like, it takes up, like, all your hand space, and you can't hold anything. You just got to kind of carry around the stone. So I will not be doing, I shall not be doing that. See, sometimes I think I'm hearing something, but it's just me moving around. I might be going a little bit slower than I need to, but guys, just jump back into the game. You know me, I'm a scaredy cat, and, you know, that's just the way, that's just the way it gots to be. All right, so we're going to continue going west. It looks like, what was it, um... 27 south. So it looks like we went too far south. So we're going to go um, uh, northwest? Yeah, northwest. Really? Looks like the way I came. Must have been going the wrong way. Hmm. I, this won't be the only time I'm going the wrong way, guys. I go the wrong way all the time. There's a snake right there. I'm going to leave him alone. And is that a nest? Yeah, it's a nest. Bird nest. Uh, yeah, I'll take it. Gives you, um, the bird nest will give you, uh, fire starting material. Alright, so let's keep going. Northwest. Yes, northwest. I keep left I'm in the east. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot of, guys, if you're new to this channel, or you have not watched me play this game, there's gonna be a lot of times where I'm saying, I gotta go one way, and I'm going the wrong way. It happens all the time. I, I can't even explain it. I, I don't know why I do the things I do. What is that? Is that him? Yeah, that's him. All right, take it easy, buddy. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna message you right now. I'm not in the uh, position to be dealing with that. Okay, so we need to go northwest. Okay, so we do need to go up this log. We need to get that way. Oh, oh, can I jump up this? I might be able to jump up this. Uh, maybe, maybe. There is one of these spots that you can jump up. Actually, I think this is it. You just gotta kind of do it right. Come up. But they did mess with the map, so who knows? Maybe I can't do it anymore. Oh, my guy's all out of stamina. You can see right there that, like, stamina bar. Yeah, this isn't going to work. I'm pretty sure I jumped up this before, but I don't know. Like I said, they've messed with the map, so... All right, I'm going to stop trying to do that because I feel like I'm wasting a lot of time. All right, we're going to go this way. I'm not really sure to get on that side. 
I thought to get on that side, I should go that way, but I don't know. And sometimes there's a snake up here. There used to be a snake up here all the time. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Look at him. Look at him. I gotta get a spear or something. Can you just make a spear out of a long stick? I think you can. God, it's been so long. I should probably make a spear. The thing is, I'd like to get some more... Uh, um, actually, I should have enough stone now. Let me see if I can make this axe. All right, guys, I figured out. I see where I was going wrong. So the idea was you need two stone, right? But you need regular stone to make the axe. I thought it would make more sense to use stone blades to make the axe, but that's not the case. So what you want to do is you want to take two of the regular stones, and then the rest of it's pretty easy. Just a rope and a stick, and you're good to go. There's the axe. That's what I wanted. Yeah, I knew it took two stones. I just, I just didn't know about the other one. I'm going to keep that pick on me for now, but I'm probably going to throw it away at some point. All right, let's see if we can make our way through the jungle without getting bit, poisoned, killed, anything like that. Um, I need to keep a lookout for some Molinaria leaves. That would be wonderful. You know, if you get attacked by something, you can kill it and you'll be fine, but you need to be able to take care of your wounds. You know what I mean? Um, actually, I probably wouldn't be fine right now because I don't have any weaponry. But theoretically speaking, if you had said weapons... Um, you know, you might, you might kill, you know, if you get attacked by like some big cat, you're going to kill the cat, but then guess what? You're bleeding out. And if you don't have any way to like deal with that, then, you know, you're not really doing yourself any, any favors. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this stick and I'm going to craft and I can make a weak spear. Can I make a, or a stone spear? I think I should be able to. I feel like I should be able to. Oh, there we go. Stone spear it is. All right. So now we got a spear. So I'm going to put this right there uh spear will be number one for my weapon axe will be number two all right so now we got a spear so that's that's beautiful okay now if i see any snakes they're freaking dead dead i tells you all right so we are going east so that's not really the way i wanted to go see that's i was heading west earlier so i wandered out of the jungle just like about a you know about 25 yards and here is a camp now you might be thinking well, this doesn't look like somewhere I'd want to stay for very long. And yeah, you probably don't want to be here for very long. But the thing is, you can learn things here. So if you look at that, I learned how to make a stone ring. I will grab the charcoal. Um, there might be some other things for me to learn around here. Um, I, can I save there? No, I can't save there, but I could sleep there. All right. Um, sleeping off the ground is definitely a good thing. And I think there... Oh, here we go. Drying rack. Cool. All right. All right, I think that's just about it. Now, I can, I got to go west. Okay, now there's a big mountain range in my way. Should I go this way and try and my, work my way around that way? Or should I go back there and work my way around that way? You know what? I've got some... Hold on. <laughs> hold on, I've got some I got some problems here. All right, so we're going to inspect. All right, because there's something wrong with me. And I need to find out what it is. Oh, it's a gross leech. Yeah, leeches are annoying. They, they don't, like, make you sick or anything, at least not as far as I know. Um, but the thing is, they'll mess with your sanity. I'm actually going to go this way and try and work my way around to the other side of this mountain range this way. Um, I have a feeling this might be the wrong way. But you know what? If we die, if we die, we die. Uh, that's a spider. Oh, God. Dude. Dude, that thing was right. I, how did he not jump on me? Man, I'm lucky. Okay, I'm dehydrating. That's not good. I didn't think I'd dehydrate that quick. I'm not used to this, um, you know, this level. Uh, can I get uh, any, of, any of that from fruit? Yes, I can. Okay, good. There we go. I'll eat the bananas too, because why not? There we go. All right, so we need to get some water. Okay, so the way to get water is we're going to need coconuts. All right? Um, coconuts, you could break them in half, and then you could, uh, when it rains, and it will rain often, this is the, you know, the rainforest, um, it'll, like, collect water for you. And uh, that's, that would probably be my best way to get water at this point. I'm spending way too much time trying to get to uh, my, the place I want to build my base and not enough time surviving. And that was really... Oh, okay. So this... Is this the elevator or... This is might be the elevator. Oh, God. Wow. That looks uh, intimidating. No, it's not the elevator. I think I know where this is. I have an idea of where I am now. Um... Well, I know where I am. I don't know how to get anywhere else from here, though. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, if you go up this way... Oh, no. They, they've they have messed around this map. They have definitely messed around this map. Okay, let's just, let's just stay focused and keep heading west. And we might have to start picking up the pace a little bit, which is not ideal. 
to be running through the jungle. I'm just going to say this is not ideal. Whoa, what is this? Oh, look at that. Yeah, they've definitely changed some of this. Um, oh, no, nothing in there. Okay. Okay. All right. I need to keep a lookout for coconuts. I probably passed about 10 coconuts. Probably. That's just that's just the way I do, you know? I always talk about what I'm looking for, and then I pass it over repeatedly. So. Ooh, that's a boar. I hope that's a boar. Actually, saying it's a boar, like, that should be, like, some kind of relief. Aren't boars, like, really... Like, really dangerous... Right? Didn't boars kill Robert Baratheon? Just saying. Alright, let's be careful here. Uh, what are we coming out to? Oh, look at this. Okay. So this is a cliff face. Um, how the hell do we get down there without breaking a limb? And it is raining, and then God knows... Guys, can you tell me how many coconuts I've passed? Has it been like 50, 55? Probably a lot. Probably a lot. Grab that nut. That's good for fats. By the way, if I die of starvation, I have to restart. I'm just going to, like, I'm going to find this place off camera. <laughs> and I'll show it to you. If, I'll show it to you. But, like, I'm going to find the place off camera, get a place to save. You know, just because I don't want to be doing this beginning stuff on camera, like, repeatedly for you guys. Because it would just get boring. All right. So, I think we can get down there coming this way. So, let's come through here. Coconut, coconut. Where are the coconuts? I know there's some coconuts around here somewhere. Couldn't I just put my mouth up in the air and just let the water rain into my mouth? Like, what, what's wrong with that? What's up with that? By the way, I think I'm in the right area for the drug lab. As a matter of fact, I know I am. But, one of the problems with the drug area is there is a puma that likes to hang out around here. Oh yeah, we're, we're heading right there. I, I recognize this area. Usually when you're in the riverbeds, you can kind of run a little bit. Oh, there we go! The drug lab! Oh, man, there's going to be so much cocaine at the drug lab. Oh, so good. Hopefully there's some water there for me. There's, there's going to be a lot of stuff there. Uh, I think I, I might even have a place to save. That would be nice if there's a place to save here. Now, I haven't been here in a few updates, so who knows? This might be a little bit different than I remember. I've heard tales of this place being super, super aggressively guarded by tribal people. Um, so we'll have to be, you know, see about that. Oh, this is a lot different. Holy crap, dude. There's like buildings and stuff up here. All right, so I can make a water collector. So you can sleep here, but you can't save. Okay, so I need to make something to save. All right, well, let's find something to save. So let's see, we got the notebook. The old notebook. Oh, a lot of stuff to go through here. We're not going to go through any of this right now because we need a place to save first and foremost. Thirsty. Uh, my guy's thirsty. Okay. Alright, so... Where do we find the thing to save? Alright, it's right here under the little house thing. The hut shelter. This is gonna be the cheapest way for us to save. Alright, so that's gonna be cool. And, uh, let's go ahead and rotate because I feel like it. There we go. And we're just gonna dump everything we can into this and build this thing ASAP. Alright, we need to save the game and we need to save it like yesterday. Alright, so let's, this is where our trusty axe is going to come into play. That's not what we need. Uh, we need... Damn it, we need one of those big old bushes with the uh, the palm fronds. But I don't feel like going out into the jungle. Uh, so let's come on over here. Is it, Can we save at these things? These look like cages. That's not good. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Yep, this is what I need right here. We need to save this thing. Like, right now. Because I'm telling you, man. Like, we could be dead at any point. Like, I, I've heard crazy stories of, like, the, the the tribal people just coming in here and wrecking face. So, alright, we can put that down. And then what do we need here? We need some more sticks. There we go. And now we need long sticks. This might actually give me a long stick right here. I hope there's some water in the area. Is there any water in the area? I don't know. It's getting a little dark here. Get a little dark, fellas. Where'd that stuff fall? Where did that fall? Oh, there we go. Long stick. We need two more long sticks. Ah, it's raining. Beautiful. Just beautiful. 
Video might be a little dark. I'm going to try not to record when it's too dark, but um, I've already done a lot off camera. So let me bring you up to speed. All right. So I went ahead and passed the night. My guy's dying of thirst. Uh, I found a cooking pot in that little fire pit there, and it is collecting water as we speak. This thing should be just about done. And I should be able to save now. There we go. That's what I was waiting for, man. I need to be able to save. So this thing will let you sleep or save. All right. If you want to save, look at, towards the top. And we're going to go ahead and hold it. We're going to do it right there. These are all old versions when I was playing before. And we have just saved the game. Ooh. Oh, man. Now I can breathe again. All right. You might be wondering why there's a little watch icon down there. That's because I'm dying of dehydration. So we're going to go ahead and come down here. Uh, these um, these cooking pots are really nice because they hold like 30 hydration, which is just, you know, phenomenal. Um, the coconuts that I failed to find only hold like 10. Whoa, what did he say? You're slowly dehydrating still? You're still dehydrating? Come on, bro. Suck it up, buttercup. Anyway, so this place is freaking awesome. And one of the new things in the update, I waited on video for this uh, because I wanted to show you, is there's now loot containers. How freaking cool is that? Ooh, that's not good. There's a dead bird. Anytime there's a dead bird, there could be one of those bird-eating spiders in the area, by the way. So let's go ahead and loot this. Wait, did I just loot it? It didn't tell me what I got. Is, is there nothing in there? That's kind of weird. I guess it was just empty. Uh, oh, a bone knife. Neat likey. Now I can make it, so that's cool. Uh, there's some more loot, stu loot stuff over here. Let's go ahead and loot. look in here. Close. Okay. So, I don't know. I guess there's nothing in these things? I Oh, there it goes. Something. Is that something? Is that cocaine? Can I take it out? Use. It's weird. So you can open these things, but I don't know if they actually, like, are lootable or anything. That's kind of weird. Anyway. All right. So let's come on down here and let's grab some more drink. There we go. That thing will continuously fill up, which is great. It is the rainy season. There are seasons in this game. Um, eventually, it won't be the rainy season anymore. We better be ready for that. But that's that's going to take a long time. I can't believe there's rocks up here. <laughs> I went looking for rocks earlier. There's rocks up here. Uh, anything in here? No. I think there were some other things I wanted to loot in here. Oh, yeah, right here. There we go. We got some crisps. Some, some freaking potato chips. I love it. Um, well, that's carbohydrates. Yeah, let's do it. It's going to dehydrate me a little bit, but what else? I can't say no to potato chips. Uh, so it doesn't dehydrate you. That's interesting. Yep, a lot of carbs, a lot of fats. Yep, that's exactly what potato chips are. <gasps> There's the map! Beautiful! Cool! Now it says press M to use the map. There we go! Awesome! So does this show me where I am? This map looks very inter- It looks very, very... I was going to say interesting. It is interesting, but it also looks familiar because I, I had one of my um, people in my chat uh, make a map. And they did a really good job because it looked a lot like this. All right. So I don't know where I am. Um, is that me? That's not me because I'm, I'm on the side of a river. Uh, so I'm not really sure where I am. Maybe I'm just missing it. Uh, watch. Right, right mouse button to zoom. Oh, cool. Yeah. I'm not really sure where I am here. Maybe I'm here? You think I could be there? I don't know. Let me know in the comments, guys. I'm sure you guys know. You guys know everything. All right. So I love this, man. This is so cool. Oh, I was hoping I could take that, like, frying pan or whatever. Let's go ahead and pick up some of these sticks. Kind of, We're going to look around the area. Make sure we're, uh, you know, okay. You can break these away, by the way, and I will. The reason I wanted to live here is because there's a big open flat area. A huge flat area here to build on. And I will be building on it. I've done it before. Um, I, didn't, I didn't finish that season, though. So I didn't get finished what I wanted to build. But I think I called it Casa de Cage. And um, I think we're going to build Casa de Cage again, guys. What is that? That looks like a tarp over there on the top, le top left. Oh, pig. Oh, there's a snake. And there's a, there's a trap right there. A uh, deadfall trap that we will be using. Punk-ass freaking snake. We're going we're gonna to harvest this sucker. Should be harvesting the snakes anyway because um, it does help your harvesting skill. Uh, I think we got to worry about water, though. I don't think we have... I don't think I picked up any um, uh, water purifying schematics or anything. So I think what we need to do is look at, keep a lookout for containers. Oh, be careful. Killer trap. Hold aim. Oh, sorry. Arm, obviously. I do have leeches on me. So there's that. Let's go ahead and get these leeches off me. And there we go. Get you off. Come on, bro. 
and get you off. Okay, we're still having some problems with water. Yeah, I think our next episode is going to be all about getting ourselves situated here, mostly about water. I mean, you know, in any survival situation, water is going to be your first, like, well, oxygen, I guess, would be more of a concern, depending on if you're underwater or maybe if you're in space or something. <laughs> but, you know, in a situation like this, I've got plenty of oxygen. Okay, so I think uh, water is going to be my main concern. We'll have to deal with that however we can next episode. But uh, listen, guys, if you want to see more of this uh, this series, you know, if you want to, if you like this game, you want to see me play this more, make sure you uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.